Hello, everybody, and welcome. This is Adrian. Thank you so much for joining today. Let's play some Bioshock Infinite. So as you guys may know or may actually not know, <clears throat> excuse me, I have played through all of the Bioshock games. Um, well, except for Bioshock Infinite, actually. I played through Bioshock 1 and 2 when the remastered editions came out. And that was a few years back, so I've always meant to do Bioshock Infinite. I never really got around to it, so I want to go back in and uh, play through Bioshock Infinite. I've actually never played through the game in its entirety, so it should be sort of an interesting interesting journey to undertake. And uh, also, my, my good friend, Mr. Smart Donkey, loves this series. He loves Bioshock. He loves all the Bioshock lore and, and everything, so he's been asking me to do this for years now. <laughs> I, I just never got back into it, but I want to finish the campaign and finish everything for him so he could see how this how this series concludes. So, I'm excited. <clears throat> um, please let me know if the audio is a little loud. I'm actually... I think I'm going to go in here to options and just, uh, just lower just a bit. Okay, oh, I'm hoping that's a little better. Okay, just let me know if it's too quiet or too loud, okay? So, alrighty, let's go and jump in. We're gonna go to the main game. <clears throat> I'm gonna go to new game. And, um... We're gonna try hard difficulty, why not? Let's do it. You've unlocked a golden pistol and machine gun upgrades. Find the weapons to equip them. Okay. You've unlocked Comstock's eye. Find a sniper rifle to equip it. Okay. Comstock's broom. Find a shotgun to equip it. Are you afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. Barriers to transdimensional travel. R. Lutechi, 1889. 1912, coast of Maine. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? I hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to shoulder What's the this? burden? No, but I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I've made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? <laughs> The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. One does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do, no. but we're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. <laughs> I see what you mean. Change anything. It might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey, is somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Well, maybe there's someone inside. Okay, so we're in the middle of nowhere. Good to know. Hey, a couple coins. God. These graphics are gorgeous. Holy shit. This game came out in 2013. I gotta admit, it looks pretty good. I can't tell. Are they leaving or are they just kind of floating there? I don't know. Huh. 
Silver Eagle, can of beans. It's a big lighthouse, man. DeWitt, bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. This is your last chance. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me? Of thy sins shall I wash thee. Good luck with that, pal. Hmm. It's kind of weird. The door's open, but it's strangely quiet in here. No more rain, huh? Jar of pickles, huh? Can of beans. From Sodom shall I lead thee. Is anyone here? Hello? signal, huh? Let's see, what are we looking at? United States of America. Be prepared, he's on his way. You must stop him. Let's see. To thine own land shall I take thee. Yeah, that's not creepy. Is that George Washington? That's a bust of George Washington. You know what's funny is I think I have one of these in my room. It's not gold though. It's like a, it's like a thing you'd find at a museum. I think I found it at like a thrift shop. Eden soil shall I plant thee. I wonder exactly where we are. I swear I saw something on our, uh... I swear I saw something about, like, some of these icons. It's a certain order. Wait a minute, that card. Yeah, there we go.
Holy shit. Why would he send us his savior unto us if we will not raise a finger for our own salvation? And though we deserve not his mercy, he has led us to this new Eden. A last chance for redemption. And the prophet shall lead the people to the new Eden. Wow, this guy thinks highly of himself, doesn't he? Find a way into the city. Found some monies. The word of the prophet. It's awfully like a Bible. The seed of the prophet. <laughs> seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. My god, look at this guy. <clears throat> Looks like a mix between God and like Poseidon or Zeus or something. And in my womb shall grow the seed of the prophet. Confession. Over eagles. Don't mind if I do. It's kind of weird though. Looks like it was a fortress of kind. It's like gone. Monies. Gotta find the exit out of this place.
love the prophet because he loves the sinner. I love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? I just want to double check real fast. Interesting. So the voxophones don't give you transcripts um, when they when they run along. Where am I? Heaven, friend, or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. I just keep such questions to myself unless I want to get made. Probably true, Booker. The Lamb, the future of our city. Sounds like monarchy, man. Is that a girl or a boy? Looks like a girl. <laughs> it's funny. That looks like a Fallout toy, doesn't it? Interesting. It's a train. Horse. Bear. That off. That looks awfully familiar. Kind of like the little sister bears. Okay, so I press shift to sprint. So I can run around. Okay. The lamb. Some bitch. Gladium. Clavum. Sword. Yeah, gladium means sword in Latin, so gladium clavum means key. Volume and volume or scripture writing. And every year on this day. We recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies at wounded knee and not railed against the Sodom beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, hmm. it would have been enough if the pro Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below? Newly come to Columbia to be washed clean before our prophet, our founders, and our lord? I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city? <laughs> Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? This or turn around and get back on that rocket. How I just want to get it over with. Come and be cleansed. Hallelujah! Oh, God. Hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Hmm. Who's there? Who's there? Bring us the curb and wipe away the deck! What do you want? We had a deal to it. Open this door right now. I told you. I'm not gonna do it. 
Go away. Mr. DeWitt! Mr. DeWitt! Idiot priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Father Washington with the sword. Father Franklin with the key. Father Jefferson with the volume. So that Eden might have laws that set her above all other nations. And so each year we recommit ourselves to our our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. Yeah, whatever you say, man. What is Columbia if not another arc for another time? Huh. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels. Watch over me and lend me strength. Shield my mind from fear and doubt. So that I may hold fast against all invaders. Rebel against ignorance Father and tyranny. Washington, Share with me prayer. your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine like a beacon through the darkness. Father Jefferson, hear my prayer. Mm. By the sword, and, and the, the scroll, scroll and, and the key. key. Amen. Amen. Send mere science and open our eyes to the mystery. Father Franklin, hear my prayer. Well, just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. So got a girl to find. The seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. Hmm. Put on here. Wow. It's a beautiful place. Something arranged. Morning. Good to see you. Actually, yeah, that's interesting. I did, I did lose health. Huh. Perfect day for the celebration. Father Comstock must have foreseen and planned it just this way. On the holy forgiveness of our dear lady huh. Comstock. I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute, you know, divinity. You sure about that? Like does not matter to a Liberty Scout. There's no room for preference, only duty. Hmm. Stall's all right, I tell you. He says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? Temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh huh. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. The, the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. 
That fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Uh-huh. Do you know what... And then the archangel showed a vision. A city. Lighter than air. I asked her, why do you show this to me, archangel? I'm not a strong man. I'm not a righteous man. I am not a holy man. And she told me the most remarkable thing. You're right, prophet. But if grace is within the grasp of one such as you, how can anyone else not see it in themselves? Huh. The word of the prophet presents Father Comstock's gift of prophecy. Great prophet foresees bright sunshine and lo, it appears. What will the great prophet reveal next? Our prophet. That's literally it. Oh, come on, man. That's a load of crock of shit. Where's the red eyes, man? That's freaky. It's Latin. It means Latin. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good day, citizen. You're looking fit. Thanks, man. I think it's over here. I think. Battle of the Wounded Knee Creek was what, 1897? Something like that? Picking the right event to attend on a day like today is serious business, you know. You can't be everywhere at once. <laughs> You'll always miss something. That's why we're going to the raffle. I have a good feeling. Hmm. Yeah, I forget when the Battle of Wounded Knee was. Um. Columbia Raffle and Fair. Weak in the key in the scroll, if you get my meaning. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> the skies, warm temperatures, and light variable winds throughout the afternoon. In short, a beautiful day for the festivities. Uh, honor system, you are on and your now, honor, put money in basket, hunters bless music. you. It's funny.
The false shepherd seeks only to lead our lamb astray. AD. Beware the false shepherd. Propaganda pieces and anything. money for the girls patriotic league <laughs> maybe next time you'd look dashing with one in your lapel come back if you change your mind Back in five minutes, huh? Hmm. Columbia's gayest quartet. <laughs> and they mean the old school definition of the word. said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Lutess. <laughs> Go to Monument Island and find the gill. Island, huh? It's a big ass city, man. Damn. I mean, look how far away that is. Look how far away all that is. Holy shit, how big is this place? Why, well, good day to you, sir. Hello. Give me all the food, man. Huh. 
It's a long way down. Look at her. Ain't she some kind of beauty? You know, that's where all the immigrants used to pass through. Which they still allowed average Janes and Joes to enter. You know, you gotta be somebody now. Hmm. So it looks like it implies that not just anybody can come to Colombia. Hello there, friend. Interesting. Roadblock. Better find another way around. Could shoot lightning from his fingers now. Would you believe me? If I told you a man could hoist a one-ton stallion straight into the air, would you believe me? I agree. Me? You keep saying well, friend, Should we go in? Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. No, sir. No, ma'am. Those are vigors I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself. Who amongst you has tasted the divine gift of the vicar? One swig and feats of wonderment are at the tips of your fingers. You know our prophet is fair. You know our prophet is kind. And he has asked, personally asked, huh. Mr. Jeremiah Fink to bring to you these amazing wonders. Praise be the envy of all his peers. <laughs> and praise be to our fair city. Are you telling me they give kids cigarettes? <laughs> You're shitting me, right? If I told you a man could shoot light. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. Sure, man. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Find the devil, good sir, and cast him out. Do you have what it takes? <laughs> oh, ship. Okay, okay, I get it. Devil number one. Oh, oh, oh. Devil number two. Woo, he's on a roll. I get it. And that's three. We have a winner. Here you go, friend. And remember, if you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is your answer. Interesting. Looks like I can get enemies out of cover, I guess. You have 40 seconds to shoot the box off the skyline. Good man. Now take aim and blast those evil box out of the sky. Hit enough and I'll get you a prize. Interesting. Got some monies. Damn. <laughs> 
<laughs> Interesting. Because they're smoking, man. What the hell? Automated stallions. in science and wonder we've seen in our lifetime. Soon enough, Fink and Lutess will be sending folks to the moon. Wouldn't that be something? Moon people. Hot dogs, hot dogs, Alexander hot dogs, Columbia's finest, worth every cent. Boxophones, boxophones, hear your voice from the past in the present. Hmm. Say something, Sonny. Well, what's a boxophone? What's a voxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. <laughs> Have you sampled any of the new videos here today? I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks, but it's safer that way. Troy and the vile members of the Vox Populi shoot the targets, earn the points, oh. win the prize. Well, here's a brave fellow. Now shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. This bucking bronco unlock no sale. Targets earn the points, win the prize. Come on down and see the amazing. Is he man? Is he machine? Only Colombian ingenuity could create such an amazing marvel. Have you ever seen anything like it? Oh. It's so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? Interesting. Step right up and see the eighth wonder of the world. He's big. He's big. Hey, friend. Have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Has a pay telephone ever refused to connect you with a beloved spouse? Well... It's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your will. Give me one of those. With just a whisper, they're all ears. <laughs> Holy shit. Press to turn machines into allies. Hmm. What the hell was that? That in 
His assault machine. Four flavors. That many? What's wrong with good old vanilla? It's funny. Howdy, sailor. What port do you call home? And employed in a storm. You know what I mean? Good old Ben Franklin. I have a weakness for this ice cream business. It's my only vice. <laughs> Sorry, pal. The raffle is all sold out. Entrance is reserved for dignitaries and very important personages alone. Tracy position on the ticket booth. Well, if it isn't Assemblyman Buford, your spot at the raffle awaits. Don't know why I didn't recognize you before. Heads. Or tails. Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. Huh. Heads. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. <laughs> it's a tails. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Health kits. Look at that one. He looks lost. <laughs> he looks just fine to me. Mary, you are a living, walking scandal. <laughs> You know, I don't know why. It's it's weird. For such a brightly lit and beautiful city, these shops and stuff like this look creepy. You know, everything boarded up, everything locked up, and I hear the Father Frank's weird. machines will be taking in new stock soon. It's interesting how a place so beautiful can feel so empty, creepy. Hmm. The things she's suffered. This little beauty? Ah, the whole division got them. We're gonna flush the box out of the skyline system. We gotta have the best. Uh -huh. They got any openings in the group? I'd love to bust some box skull. Interesting. Our Lutichi gave Columbia her wings. Songbird. Madame Lutess, I have read all your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you were allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. Shall know the false shepherd by his mark. 
<laughs> it's just pop drink, but it's like PAP pop drink. Monument Island closed. Is that a bug? Ah, oh, looks like a texture bug. Interesting. This is it. This is it. I feel like I've waited all year for this. Buying baseballs? sale <laughs> silly there's never a charge for the raffle you've been sleeping under a rock 77 77 that's a lucky number i'll be rooting for you bring me the bowl is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of columbia <laughs> all right then the winner is number 77 oh, what do you know Number 77, come and claim your prize! First throw! Jesus. Please. Please don't do this. It was me. It was all me. Please. Please. No. Please, what are you doing? Come on. Are you going to throw it? Or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> Oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. Throw a couple, throw the announcer. Got to do something about that. I know what to do. Got something for you, Time's son of a bitch. Up. Wait. Uh, it's him. Uh, now, where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? The false shepherd. And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys. Jesus. Stop him! Stop him! The full shepherds come to me! Come on now! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Holy shit! This way, cover the gate. Get in there. Oh, he's got a pistol. Holy shit, dude! Son of a bitch! 
Damn! Alright. We got ourselves a pistol. Got plenty of ammo. Curious. We need to get there. I told you, Comstock. You sell them paradise, and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well... I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Uh, let's see. Possession aid. Uh, adds ability to possess humans whose suicide when the effect expires. Okay, so possession will now work on humans, I guess. Let's buy this. Has the ability to possess humans who suicide only if it expires. Okay. Cool. Possession now turns machine and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap. See right mouse to turn machines or people into allies. Hold the release to create a possession trap. Cool. Okay. What's this dude? Salts? Huh. Oh, what the hell? Holy shit! Scare the shit out of me! Yeah. This one's pretty accurate, man. I like it.
Looks like we gotta get over there. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. How's the fireman? Give me all the things. That shit, holy shit. The vigor. It's a kiss. Well, you only live once. YOLO! sample <laughs> all right cool all right well this seems like a good place to take a break guys um we still gotta get to monument island and find the girl so i'm gonna take a break here uh i think this is a checkpoint i'm hoping so anyway yeah all right i will see you guys in the next episode thank you so much for watching as always please make sure to like subscribe and comment hope you guys enjoying bioshock infinite this is getting pretty interesting. I'm, I, I, it was kind of a slower episode, but that's all right because we get to explore the world and now we're getting into some combat. So this should be interesting. So thank you so much for watching as always, guys. And uh, I'll see you soon. Thanks so much.